Hey guys, Kadisha. I'm back with another video. Uh, it's a little gloomy out today, so forgive me for the lighting. Uh, but I wanted to tell you to not get weary in well doing. Uh, of course, I always have a story. Uh, at work, I had this particular thing that I did not like to do. I was just like, oh my, this is horrible. I don't like to do it. This should not be my responsibility. And I'm just like, I do not want to do it. But after I took a, I took an approach, a different approach when it was time to do it. I had like a different attitude. And I was like, you know what? I'm about to just do this and do it as unto the Lord, you know? I'm just going to do it with a positive attitude. And am I going to say like it happened the next day where I was like, oh, I'm fine doing it? No, no, that's not what I'm saying at all. But once I decided to change my attitude about it, it became so much easier for me to do. And not necessarily like I looked forward to doing it, but I didn't have a problem doing it anymore. And I started just like, okay, yeah, it's time to do it, you know, whatever. And I did it. And I was just like, oh my, it's amazing how if we change our attitude about certain things, that it will just basically uplift you and make you, I don't know, not necessarily happier to do it, but make you not so, um, I guess, bitter, if that's the word. So, uh, yeah, I hope this was encouraging to y'all to just keep going because it reminds me of the story of David. You know, David was tending the sheep. Like, who wants to tend sheep? No, nobody, you know? So uh, he continued to do it, and he was being faithful and, you know, doing it as unto the Lord. And next thing you know, the Lord anointed him for Israel, you know, to be the king of Israel. So we have to remember, like, those jobs that we may not like, like they're uh, actually pruning you and actually growing you in areas that you need to grow in order to step into the call that God has called you to or that God has for you. And so those tedious uh, little tasks that you may not want to do, they're actually uh, more probably of a humbling experience. And we can also talk about, you know, Joseph as well, the story of Joseph. So yeah, y'all uh, keep going, keep pushing forward because hey, your best is right in front of you. All right. I hope y'all have a great week and uh, thank you for watching this video. But also remember to be the change that you want to see in someone else. Until next time. Bye.